Hello everyone, welcome again to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can download and install Quantfi for your GTA 5 game. With Quantfi, your gaming experience will be brought to the next level. The visual effects on this modification is amazing. Two additional to that, you'll also get an F5 menu, which will act like a simple trainer, and you can change the graphics, spawn vehicles, spawn weapons, turn on guard mode, change the weather and change the time and much much more so let's not waste any more time as you can see it is awesome without further ado i would love for you all to smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel so let's get started okay so let's get started on my left side i have my grand theft auto main directory folders and on my right side i have my discord server so feel free to join that for the links that we're visiting also if you don't want to join it uh, I'll, you'll see the links right here on the screen uh, we do have a support page and we have install service where we install lspdfr or anything else um yeah for this uh, for this story we're gonna go to the gta 5 graphics and we're gonna download and install quant v we're gonna use a clean version of grand theft auto so i switch over from my games as you can see i have multiple gta 5 games i switch over by them just by changing the names to the right format and now we will be playing with that one so that's pretty easy um next step we need open iv we need script v and we need quant v itself open iv currently is not working as you can see the website is down so you can just download the file directly from my discord server the next thing we're going to be needing is script v and quant v itself so join their discord um i'm here in their discord also where is it right here so also they're very helpful and uh yeah stay also there for quant v you need to download it from here after you got the license of course and yeah we've got open iv let's download script v and the downloaded quant v files i've already downloaded those let's hop over to our download folder by the way you download the quant v directly from their discord as you can see right here you have the single player and that's the one that we're going to be installing today so here we have the open iv script v and the quant v single player and the base mount you need to download these two files after you've received the link from the discord for the single player you will open it up and right here it will tell you um, if you open this it will download the base mod this is the one we're first going to install of the two so let's start let's start by going to open iv double click on it and hit continue it's gonna uh, get the files for you after that you choose your file destination for the installation and then it will install it so i already have it installed uh, i'm going to show you how it uh, opens for the first time you're just going to search for open iv on your computer right click on it and run as administrator click yes and we're going to click for windows let it load up and then we're going to click on what can i do click set permissions and close it up then we're going to tools and we're going to click on asi manager and then we're going to install the asi loader the open iv and we're going to create the mods folder and we're going to install open camera now we're good to go and we can actually close up open iv so let's open up our grand theft auto main directory folder the clean version and let's extract script v by right click on it right click on it and click on extract where is it right there we're going to open it up we're going to open the bin folder and we're going to select the files that i select and we're going to drag and drop them in the grand theft auto main directory folder and we can actually replace the files and then we're going to go back we're going to go back again and then we're going to go head over to the base mod single player we're going to right click on it and we're going to hit extract all and there it is we're going to go to install and we're going to double click on the base mod installer it's an open iv uh, file so it will automatically open it up for you 
if you don't see that you can automatically open it up i'm going to show you in the next phase how you can do that we're going to click on install we're going to click on install to mods folder and confirm it so that's option number two but if you don't have this option to double click on it all you have to do is just open open iv again after this is done almost and then we're going to close it up we're going to open up open iv click on windows let it load up so we're done with the base mod let's go to the uh quant v single player right click on it and hit extract all and here it is we're going to go to install and what you can do here is you can hit edit mode click on yes and drag and drop the quant v install on the open iv click install click install to mods folder confirm the installation and boom there you have it there is in a, there is even a third option how to install this is by clicking on tools and then packet packet package installer and then you will select this file let it load up okay besides that if we go back to the base mod single player you also have optionals optional presets and here you can actually choose some things um like puddles covering foreground floor is a mirror well i recommend that one let this one uh, get done okay it's ready let's install full puddle so that's going to be the rain on the on the floor with the reflection double click on it and it will open it up i also love brighter emergency lights Click on install, install the mods folder, confirm it please, and let's go to the next one. So it has a lot of options, uh, which makes it really awesome, this, this graphic uh, modification. Let's double click on very bright lights. Let's see what else do we like. So you can test all these. Um, long draw distance. Okay so you have a lot of options here i'm gonna keep it for now for these two i don't want motion blur so i'll just keep everything like how it is close let's go ahead and check so this was the base mod let's check what the single player has to offer maybe there's also uh some things so here are the performance quality you can uh, set e and b um I am also just going to keep it like this for now. Ah, raindrops. Very interesting. So we can do raindrops on vehicle windshield. I'm just going to install all three of them, which I haven't done that until now. So I'm pretty curious how that's going to look like. I don't know if it's even possible. So here you also, he, the owner, the creator has also made these yeah, short videos on how it will look like. Okay, so yeah, the racing style I like. Um, install, install the mods folder, confirm. I don't know if it's possible to do all three. I guess I'm just gonna try. Let's see what happens. Close. Double click on this one. So as you can see, the creator made this so easy for you that you don't need to copy, cut, anything, edit files. It's just installing it through OpenIV, which is practically the easiest thing you can do within Grand Theft Auto modding. There you go. And then this one, maybe we see something else. So the volumetric clouds, I also love. I am going to skip it for this tutorial. Let's see. Uh, Starfield Galaxy. Just look at that. That is awesome. So you have the option to install these also. Uh, snow. Shadows. Here. Yeah. So that's, that's a lot of work being put in this snow oh we already walked through that clouds um metallic paint let's do that 
So this is how it's gonna look like. Wow. So he has focused on this, he blurred the outside of course. So you see the difference. And the other one. Damn. You see you really see that shining part. So I'm gonna install both of them. That's metallic paint plus iridescent metal. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correct. But uh yeah, I guess we're done after this. Let's go ahead and also play it see how it looks like yeah the last thing that you can actually do is actually choose one of these um hyper will take the most out of the performance impact gives you the best uh, quality of course i have a uh, rtx 3090 i did try this it's still with the rtx 3090 i think you need a 4090 but hey uh, I have it on 4K running, so I'm recording on 1440p, by the way, but I'm running the game at uh, 4K. Uh, I have some issues currently with OBS, that's why I uh, probably need a Windows reset, uh, but that's a different story. So yes, um, I am going to skip this for now, because if you're interested in one of these, you can just double click on it. Let's go ahead and start up Grand Theft Auto, shall we? Okay, Grand Theft Auto is started up as you can see. The visual effects are amazing. The raindrops, the rain on the floor, the graphics itself, the lighting. It is a full on full success. So yeah, let me know what you think about it. Let me know if you need any help in installing it. I gotta say, it is amazing, just the colors everywhere. And just keep in mind, my graphics, let's walk through to my graphics. I have a 3090, I'm only using 3600 video memory out of the 24,000. Like, you can make this all much higher. And it will use at least 10k. So this is how I have it set it up. This is not the max. Also, in my NVIDIA settings, um, it's also set very low. Let's see how the uh, F5 menu. Let's just see our FPS. That's that's a lot. 70, 70 FPS. That's a lot. 60, 80. So yeah, that is awesome. It is a success. Uh, so yeah, this is how it looks like. It is awesome. And that being said, we're towards the end of the video, folks. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. Thank you all for watching and goodbye.